Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank each and every one of y'all for clicking on the video. Well, today we are going to be in the tiny cabin. It is extremely, extremely windy here in Oklahoma this last week. I'm going to tell you what, it has bothered my allergies so bad. My eyes are just been, yeah, it's terrible. So I'm glad we're going to be working in the tiny cabin. Um, we're going to be putting this trim up, but what we're going to have to do before we put all the trim up is we're going to have to paint it. So what I'm going to do is get the tarp and we're going to lay it under here, make sure it doesn't get on the floor. And then we will come back and I've got to put this door in and, um, but there's a reason why we've got some bad, bad, bad news again. Um, I'm telling you, I, I, I don't know. I, I'm beginning to think this little tiny cabin is cursed, to be honest with you. So um, luckily, we're not going to have to rip up the floor. But uh, Steph was in here uh, yesterday uh, doing some laundry, and she heard some dripping. So we got to doing some investigation. Well, our water line... This is our, our water line. I, I left a little hole in here because that's we shut it on and off from here. Uh, I'm just gonna get a little plastic door put over it once you know we get everything done in here. But we got to looking and I started feeling around in here yesterday and there was actually water dripping and going on the floor. As you can see, there is the floor is wet right there and uh, we're not going to pull everything out and pull up the floor. It's not that bad. So what I ended up going outside because I couldn't remember if we put a, a, a floor or a, a water cut off outside. So I got to looking underneath and it was actually leaking underneath. So the whole time when I thought that the um, commode was leaking. It wasn't the commode and I was right. There was another leak there because I could tell how dark it was. It was coming from that wall there, but it is so strange because this, we had the water line and everything in for almost three months before we started putting up, um, the, uh, the sheetrock and stuff. So I don't know why it's all, all of a sudden leaking. But uh, I actually, uh, I was talking to Keeping It Dutch the other day, and I told him, or yesterday, I told him, I was like, man, the water's leaking in the main. He was like, where at? I said, we're in the main. The, the main part where you actually put the sheetrock up, I think you put a screw in my water line. So um, he said, are you serious? It would have been, I'm just joking. Um, what I'm thinking is, is one of the fittings is at the very top is going to be bad. Um, we had some issues with it um, with the we had to go get some extra pipe and the pipe was I don't know I should have should have just went and bought a full another road but I didn't want to buy a full road because that was all we needed so um, I went back and looked at the videos and oh, let me go in here and I'll show you like I said, I went back and looked at the videos. The water line is actually up here in the ceiling here. So we're, I'm gonna cut a hole right here in this ceiling. Hopefully I can get access there and get to the water leak. So I don't know. I really haven't found out all the damage yet. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and paint this baseboard and stuff. And then at, that way it can be drying. And then I'm gonna go ahead and bust through the ceiling. And we may have to bust through this wall as well. So unfortunately, we're, it seemed like we go a couple steps forward and 10 steps backwards, but uh, we're gonna get through this. We're not gonna let us get it down. You know, like the other day, hey, I'm perfectly, I mean, I could be upset. I am not fully upset, but I'm a little bit, but you know, one good thing about it was my doctor results and all that was good earlier in the week. So, Hey, that makes me feel better. Um, yeah, so we're just going to have to deal with it and we'll fix these issues as we go. Um, maybe one day we will get a move in here. Um, but I don't know if I actually showed this on our channel, but I did end up getting, Stephanie, um, a new washer and dryer. 
and um, that's been working out really well. Um, the mirror, the mirror is just here to so we can brush our teeth and stuff. Um, eventually, I'll probably take out the the um, AC units and close that off, but. I might build a frame to where we can put that mirror there. I don't know. We'll just kind of see how it goes. Um, hopefully, one of these days, we'll start making several steps forward and none backwards. But I'm going to set this up, and then I'm going to lay this tarp out, and we're going to get started. Just got a off white that we're going to paint the baseboards. That should be good enough. they love to hang out with me in the mornings. They will almost follow me anywhere on the place. Gary, what do you want? You and your loud mouth, buddy. Huh? Well, come here. You can't have those treats. I don't have any treats here this morning. Yeah, I don't have any treats here this morning. Let me go get some over here. So the treats that the turkeys get to eat is dog food. They love dog food. Well, come here. Well, come here. Well, come on. Here comes cowboy. Well, come on. Well, come on. Y'all better hurry before the goats get over here. Come on, cowboy. I don't recommend feeding dog food to your chickens. That's just what mine do. See, now you got all the goats up here. It's okay. Poor Oscar. His old legs are about to give out on him. Come here, Oscar. Oscar loves dog food. Here. you some lady lady friends later on. No, Jerry. I said no. We are not going to be mean today. Jerry. Jerry. Hey. No. No, we're not going to do that. That hey. Jerry. Leave him alone. Now. I know, we'll get you some lady friends later on, but you ain't gonna do that. He's trying to be all mean. Hey, hey, hey. Now, I was trying to protect you, and now you're trying to jump on Cowboy. Well, I know, but you can't be acting like that. Now, come on. I'm gonna, I got this small one to finish the, the trim around the tiny cabin one of these days because I still got this room and part of this room and the other two rooms. But we keep having other issues pop up before we get everything done. So it's all gonna work out. And we wanna thank each and every one of y'all for watching our videos and showing all y'all's love and support. Y'all's comments 
are so amazing how kind y'all are and we can't we can't thank y'all enough for that and uh, yeah please continue liking and subscribing and sharing our videos we had 99 videos shared uh, this last month they sent us an update and we had 99 videos shared this last month so it'd be pretty cool I think it was 99 I don't know but uh, please continue liking and sharing we greatly appreciate that we're going to set this over here all right, so I'm gonna put this here. We'll pour a little bit in there. I don't have a uh, liner, so we're just gonna have to go with what we got here today. there what is that this is a house a gingerbread man house yeah so we got a gingerbread house here oh gingerbread man well look at that guys she kind of ate some of the candy i see that <laughs> there you go all right well daddy's gonna try to finish this All right, guys, this is the last piece here. We're gonna get it cut up and, or painted up. And then we're going to set, let these dry. Then we're gonna go see what the damage is up there. So hopefully I can find the exact location without having to tear a whole bunch of this down. That's what scares me is not having to cut a bunch of it, but we'll see. I just don't want to, I just don't want to make it hard to repair it. Right, we're going to set these over here and let these guys dry. Huh? I'm pretty sure them over here should already be dry, but I'm going to go ahead and set this stuff outside. I know the lines go straight up from here. I want to go ahead and put a, a pretty good size hole in here. Something you can get at least two of your arms in. Yeah. Where's the electricity at? Huh. You know, record inside there with this. Bathroom, then. Like there's the water line. 
All right, so right, right here's the water line. You can see the red water line. Did we get that lucky? Is that where it's at? No. I was thinking the same exact thing. And then obviously you can't vent. But. Go ahead and turn that on. The water? Yeah. Down, it's in the cold? Yeah. I hear it filling the toilet. Right there it is. Really? Yeah. Oh, I can see it over here though, hitting yeah. the wall. Can I turn it off? Uh, Is that maybe a simple fix where you can just tighten that ring up? Mm -mm. No. Or put some silicone let's on it or something? All right, let's see. There it is right there. It's the bottom one. But I remember this one. We was really shy on this. So to fix this, I'm probably going to have to go, go to fix this so we don't have this issue anymore. I'm probably going to have to make a hole into here and get another piece to run down in here because this line here is different from what everything else is. So could you just get the, make like maybe this big or something? And just wring it off. Yeah, and, but I'm going to have to put a hole into here. Yeah, to do it. So, I mean, it is what it is. It's going to be work to get it all back. What's going to happen is we're going to paint this place here probably three or four times, and then I'll put another coat trying to blend it in. One thing after another. Uh, all right, so we're going to go up here to the storage building up here and see if we can find I know I bought a large roll of uh, pecs, but that was after this. And I gotta get some cutters and stuff so we can cut this and go ahead and fix it. I thought we did. I, I know thought... I got stuff up there I gotta use. So. All right, we got our cutters, we got the clamps, we got the elbow, and I forget what they call that. But anyway, we got it. Now we just got to find the uh, the pipe. I don't know where. I don't think I would bring it down here, but let me just go through and see. Yeah, there it is. Our junk stash. This is our junk pile stash, and I'm gonna show you the difference. What happened is we ended up not having enough, so we went to town and bought a, a roll that was local besides driving back to Ardmore, and this is what we should have had. And you can tell the difference by the color and the fitting. So let's see if we can find the end of this without opening it all up. Oh, there it is. So we're going to cut some of that and I'll show you. Oh my goodness. So this is the area that every YouTuber has, but where you just keep everything stashed away. But uh, someday we will use some of this. So look at the difference. And this is the reason why we're in the situation. This is what the whole place is ran with. But I went to town and bought this and looked the inside of that. 
So it's going to be my mess up, but what I did was I should have bought the fittings at this hardware store for it, but I didn't. I just used the fittings I had, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. This is the, the Nandi. That 90 fits in there just like that. Look how loose that is. So that's the problem. My fault, but live and learn, live and learn. All right, so we got everything now. We think. We think. Oh, I do need to get some just regular cutters because I've got to cut them in two. Turn that water on over there real quick. Run all the water up. There's another water line right there. But it ain't leaking. All right, so I'm gonna come in here and cut this and hopefully I can get in this way. Holy cow. Oh, All right, after looking, this end here is not leaking. Um, it is loose, but it wasn't leaking. It doesn't matter if I change this out and, and put a splice piece in there, there's still going to be um, this, I can't replace this whole line. So I'm gonna cut this back and splice it so there's a little bit more room to work with. Dad's, dad's fixing it. Is the water like a thing? Yeah. So all the water's going all the way up there? Mm-hmm. They go through the walls. That's how the, wash, the washer so runs. So it goes down there. there to up here? Yep. Mm. Then how did it get a water leak? Well, just the pop didn't work. Oh, did it break or something? Yeah. Right, turn the water on. Are you sure? <laughs> you want me to do? You want me to do this one, then that one, yeah, or just that, that one? Oh, right, guys, oh. the water. All right, guys, the water is on now, so we're gonna monitor it. See if there's any leaks. We're gonna watch it and see if there's any leaks and uh, just kind of go from there. 
All right, guys, so we got the water on. It doesn't show to have any leaks right now. Um, obviously, we're going to leave this open for a few days until we make sure there's no more leaks. And then after that, we're going to come in and uh, we'll patch this up and try to make it look nice again. Um, unfortunately, I have no clue why this happens. I don't know. I'm glad the toilet's right here because I might have never known. Yeah. The only reason the only reason we know there was a water leak was I was going potty and I could hear like a like a real like a light tap, like water dripping, but it sounded really really light, and that's what it was. So we're gonna get some fans in here. We're gonna put down here. We're gonna put fans underneath to start drying it out and uh, hope for the best. So anyways, um, we got a lot of things going on, so we still got a lot of stuff to do. If you enjoy the animals, stay tuned. We're fixing to go out, feed the animals, and, and visit with them for a while. Feed the animals and enjoy them for a little bit. Get out of that state of mind. It's, if it ain't one thing, it's another. What are y'all doing? Are y'all ready for dinner? Huh? Y'all want some dinner? You want some dinner? You want some dinner? I know you want some dinner, don't you, Dixie? Yes, yes. They're Carly girl. They're Carly girl. Yeah. They're Dixie or Toby. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all some lovin's. Yeah. Look at them. They love that lovin's. Yes. Yes. Y'all are so precious. Y'all are so precious. Yeah. Oh. Toby's like, no, no. <laughs> All right, let's get some food rolling. I know it don't matter if I feed y'all first, y'all still gonna come over here. Hey. <laughs> I got like, a plan for the, to the gate. <laughs> Psych. <laughs> I got a plan for the Billy. You better go over there. Follow him over there. He started to jump up here and he was like, oh, there's a line there. <laughs> Why is it so wet right here? Um, did you have that water hose on yesterday? Uh-uh. Okay, a goat did it. We're gonna have to get some lock. That one up there is a lot easier. I turned it off this morning. Y'all some pretty girls. Y'all know it? I know. Where's Bushwhacker? How are y'all today? Huh? We're getting ready to go get some feed. Y'all ready to go get some feed? Yeah. You want some feed? How about you? You want some feed? You want some feed? Now, uh, Toby, you can't have all the lovin's. Yeah. You want to hand me that other bucket over there? All right. Try to get him in right now. Yeah. Romeo! I'll have to pour some out here. Yeah. Yeah. Here we go. Here you go. There you go. You want some feed? You want some feed? All right. Here we go. All right. 
Y'all ready for some feed? Well, y'all gotta move. Hey! 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 We're not gonna play that game. We don't do that kind of stuff. So you can sit back there until I'm done feeding. Nope. Nope. You get back. Nope. You're going to learn we ain't going to play that game. Nope. Get back. How are you? Huh? You want a little bit of feed? Come on, Romeo. Good job. That's a good job. Here, here, Romeo. Well, come here. I think you the best thing with all the kids being you here is just start getting along with Badger. <laughs> you got to start getting along with Badger. Quit. It's okay. Come on. Go. There we go. <laughs> Just run with them, run with them. <laughs> Go. Whoa, no, no. That was, <laughs> that was a close one. Go. Come on. Go. Go. Romeo. Stop. Addison, open the gate. Come on. You won't be nice. All right, shut it. Okay, guys, so. We got the dogs, or we got the goats fed, so now we gotta go get the dog feed. And uh, I got some buckets we're gonna be putting all the dog feed and stuff in, and we're gonna start leaving them out here. I ended up, uh, I've been looking for some barrels that I can actually pour the dog feed and, and uh, chicken feed in so we can leave it out here. So as soon as I find them, we're gonna order them because that way all the feed's over here and we don't have to worry about it. Here we go. Look at them girls and boys waiting for y'all some good doggies. Oh, wow. I'm going to have to go in there. and Their food bowls are moved, so I'm going to have to go in here and move them back to where they need to be. Yeah, we're going to go over here and move these food bowls. Everybody eating good, looking good? Yes. Yeah, that's one thing. Used to, Carly would jump up on me and I loved it and enjoyed it, but when the kids would come out here, Carly would jump up on the kids and uh, it wasn't right because the dog don't know the difference. There you go. There y'all go. These, these turkeys, they like the dog food too, so I end up giving them dog food. I'm gonna fill this up so we can feed the outside ones. Can I feed them? The bucket would be a little too heavy for you. Hold this. Here, Jordan, you're just waiting for the feed up here, huh? All right. Air Jordan. Yeah, old Air Jordan. She like or he. Yeah, she likes jumping up here eating. Anyways, guys, we're gonna go up here and get the chicken feed and go ahead and feed the chickens. Hopefully, one day this week we get to go up there and start on the chicken coops up there. If nothing else happens down here. But um, also, guys, don't forget we still have tons of shirts available, and the hoodies should be coming in any day. Um, you will receive your hoodie for Christmas on that pre-order, but uh, we still have tons of these available. So go check them out at eddiefamilyfarm.com, and we'd greatly appreciate all your love and support. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to like and subscribe, 
And guys, share these videos. Let's see if we can get 200 shares for this month. So we should get 200 shares. So make sure you like and subscribe and share these videos. So hope each and every one of y'all have a wonderful day. God bless.